The intensity of the clashes on the front lines of the Ukraine-Russia war continues to increase day by day. While the Ukrainian army continues offensive and defensive operations on many fronts, the Russian army is attacking intensively to retake the lost territories. The general staff of the armed forces of Ukraine reported the developments in the last 24 hours. Let's take a look at these developments with you. The Bakhmut front remains one of the most critical fronts since the beginning of the war. The Ukrainian army continues its offensive operations south of the city of Bakhmut, making significant advances east of Klitschivka and east of Andrivka. The Ukrainian defense forces also successfully repelled Russian attacks near the settlement of Andrivka. The Liman front is one of the fronts where Ukraine has intensified its defensive operations. The Russian army is launching very intense attacks on this front. The Russians attacked the settlements of Makivka in Luhansk Oblast, as well as the Torska and Serebryanka forest areas in Donetsk Oblast. The Ukrainian army repelled more than 15 Russian attacks on this front. On the Avdivka front, the Ukrainian army continued its defense. It successfully repelled more than 10 Russian attacks near Avdivka and 10 attacks near settlements east of Stepove, southeast of Sieverne and south of Permovinska in Donetsk Oblast. On the Marinka front, more than 10 attacks organized by the Russian army were repelled by the Ukrainian forces. On the Melitopol front, the offensive operations of the Ukrainian forces continued unabated. The tactical situation west of Robotina in Zaporizhia Oblast was improved, and the Russian army suffered heavy losses.